must have a vision, of course. And uh, agriculture could bring you from rags to riches. And if you do not manage your affairs, you could go back from riches to rags. Alban Thomas, a 92-year-old farmer, has been recognized as the oldest farmer in St. David. Thomas was among 50 farmers awarded at his ceremony in their honor at the Lassagest Plain Field in St. David on Sunday. Hosted by the Ministry of Agriculture, the award ceremony was intended to reward farmers from the Southern Agricultural District for their contribution to Grenada's food security. Mr. Thomas and Mr. Martin Hines, both seniors who have been in the farming business for decades, had this advice for young people. The thing is, to get into agriculture, you must have a vision. Young people, they must have a vision. And I'm, I'm, I'm begging them, go back to the land. Go back to the land. This land has a lot of potential. And um, the same Moroka you have, in selling the land and buying Moroka, this land could give you Moroka. In spite of the, um, the challenge we have with the Pyralasmi and the thieves, don't give up. Keep, keep strong faith. Continue to go. Brian Hazard was recognized as the most outstanding youth in agriculture, while Christian Niles was awarded the youngest male in agriculture. I feel great you know, knowing the amount of hard work and you know, dedication. The sun, the rain, you know, you have to keep going. Yeah. Keep, a, keep at it, you know. Farming is not no easy, easy work, but you have to keep, you have to keep yourself motivated. When I was younger, my, my, my dad had a farm and I, I used to go on the farm and I love reaping the crops, so that just brought me into agriculture. Well, I feel great and inspired. Salisha Mashal from La Femme St. David, who was awarded Nursery Farmer of the Year, said she found comfort in farming. It started at a young age, but what I'm more, I'm more involved in is nursery. So I do seedlings, vegetables, um, like lettuce, cabbage, and I also do herbs. It always is a family or generational. My mom, my grandma, my dad, everyone. So I just continued on when I realized that's where I'm more comfortable and happy. Senator Adrian Thomas shared the objectives of the Ministry of Agriculture as one bent on emulating farmers, while Pomen Secretary Isaac Bagwan explained what is in the pipeline. Well, it, was, it, was, it was nice today to see a 12-year-old got recognition for his involvement in farming, and there are quite a few young people here also. Um, the blend with male and female was very nice also. Um, we had a farmer 92 years and he's still in the business of farming and we had, and we had young people. I think it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a way that we can encourage young people to come forward. Agriculture is serious business and there's a lot we can earn from doing agriculture. So the young people must see it as an opportunity, as an option in terms of creating their own livelihood. Um, farmers are not recognized for the work that they do. And so and we felt as part of the independence celebration that we should do something for farmers. And so um, this is the inaugural. The intention is um, next year to, and every year thereafter to have um, a farmers recognition day, recognizing farmers, as I said before, in different categories. Um, Chris Lena John, GBN News.